Welcome, welcome. Hey everybody, it's Dusk, and once again, we're back with another episode of Let's Play Get Wars 2. Alright, let's check a look at the new content. What is this one? No. Uh, oopsie. <laughs> I done goofed. Uh, let's check the other one then. Embarrassing. <laughs> Don't say no to it. <laughs> say yes. Into the command core. Where our instance of choice. Level 80? Say what? <laughs> oh man. Well, we'll find out how crazy this is. Okay. It's it's been a while since I've been in this place. Alright, so we gotta go up. Sorry. Right. And as a human, we've never gone here, so. Aha, here it is. We'll talk about that later. I've got a mission for you. You're aware of the refugee situation. Yes, Tribune. I heard the Flame Legion have been mobilizing in northern Vieza Plateau. You heard right. They're mucking with our assets up there. It's singeing my fur. I need you to secure that hatchery we discussed. You think you can handle that? Yes, Tribune. I'll leave right away. Good. Take any support you can find. You're likely to need it. Yes, Tribune. Hmm. Interesting. What's up, Rox? What's your story? Huh. Attacking a hatch at Port Defense's baby devourers. That's evil at its worst. Wow. Flame Legion are dicks. The hatchery is north of the town of Nolan Diastu Plateau. I'll meet you there. Bring any friends who want to come too. Alright. How do I get there? Alright, sounds good. Another personal victory. <laughs> well, this is just a story. I wouldn't count it as a personal victory. Interesting, though. Very interesting. I wonder how hard they are. Then we'll find out. But there's another one over here too. It's, it's, uh, hmm. We're gonna meet Bram as well. Duh. As I said, they should be Brams, yep. But first, let's read this, read this letter. Did you say you'd go along with my soldier rocks to defend our hatchery, right? I read it in your eyes. In any case, I wanted to make sure you knew how appreciative I'd be if you did. Also, where to go? Well, that's pretty easy. But, let's see. Aha, because it's in kind of a newish location. Ah, kind of. <laughs> yes. Whoa, that's a pretty badass picture. <laughs> All right, Bram. I have to send troops. My friends, my home. We're losing everything. People are dying. Who do you think you are, barging into my office like this? My people are hunters. You don't know how to fight an army? True, but that doesn't make me your keeper. You're in the wrong place. Go talk to Newt White Bear. I'm up to my eyeballs as refugees. I'm Air's son. I heard. Oh shit. Air has no son. Get out of my office. Now. Air's son, huh? Is he making that up? Since when did she have a kid? Those Norn need to take care of their own messes. Wow. Ridlock, you're being a bit of a dick here, dude. Don't suppose you want to help come convince White Bear to send muscle. Hmm. Huh. I have some ghosts from my past that I try to avoid. My mother, to be specific, it never ends well whenever she and I are in the same room. I barely know her anyway. <laughs> I'm the cleavage, and you are? Bram. Bram Harrison. Wow. A famous hero of Destiny's Edge, huh? Sheesh. Another personal victory. Holbrook, okay. Interesting, interesting. What do you gotta say, Redlock? What's your excuse? <laughs> Who let this tourist in here? So why didn't you help the Norn? 
Can't spare a single soldier? He lied to you. Huh. Heir's son. I've known her for years, and she didn't mention she had any kids. He underestimated my relationship with her. Really? Would he really lie about that? I don't think so. Pretty weird. Pretty weird. Well, anyhow, let's go to the Austin Plateau and try out this living story mission. It's going to be interesting, but first, letter. As long as you're going to Holbrook, you are going to Holbrook, right? Give that mangy old bear, Kunit White Bear, a message for me. Tell him I've got Norn refugees showing up in my office, blah, 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 I don't appreciate it. Heft a Norn Ale for me, too, will you? <laughs> really luck, really luck, really luck. Fuck, I said your name wrong. I don't care anymore. The Great Botch. Okay. Well, that's easy enough. That's for if you've never, ever explored, I guess, is why they give you directions, because it's actually not hard to get there. And speaking of not hard to get, let's do this. We'll be back. We're gonna go see how bad this new, uh, or good this instance is. Might be hard, might be easy, who knows. Okay, we're back. And now we're gonna go into the first instance. Nolanorf Hatchery. Here we go. Oh boy. How bad is this gonna be? Let's find out. Hi, Rox. Close. I scouted around while waiting for you. It doesn't look good. I'm seeing signs of rage. Very fast and silent. It simply doesn't go anywhere. Huh. We go fast and mean. Fast and mean, alright. Fast and mean. Wait, something's not. We're scaled up to 80, by the way. Oh, goodness. Um, you gonna help us? <laughs> I sure would be nice, Roman. It's nice our stats are skilled, but I don't think our equipment is. <laughs> uh, I'm afraid. Oh, no. Please. Fox, no! Or take out the invaders. As you can see, uh, they're now called Moltens. And they now kind of blend together much better. And now they're moles that shoot fire. Dredge that shoot fire. As if they weren't annoying enough. Yeah. Oh! No, Rox. Oh! If you're Hugh or something. Wow, she actually listened to me. That's creepy. It's got voice recognition. Wouldn't that be pretty amazing? Oh man. Oh. I need to play illusions. <laughs> what? Who will be feeling that one for days? Are you talking to me, Fox? Wait, what? The the bar still says You crazy rocks. The bar says there's more. You got an interesting look too. <laughs> A little more cat like. Oh boy. Oh god. <laughs> How about not? Taste this. Instead, taste my blade. <laughs> that doesn't sound intimidating at all. Taste my blade and my foot guy. Haha. <laughs> That's better. Two down. Whoa! Ravaging Flamebow of Earth. We got a rare, folks. That's pretty neat. I'm gonna have to give that to my ranger. Oh, let's check the stats on that baby. Oh, she's sorry, rocks. Time. Oh shit. Now's not a good time to be checking the our loot. Let's check after. <laughs> That's what I don't like about MMOs having limited inventory space. Like, how are you gonna check something awesome to get in the middle of an intense situation like that? Please. You're not, you get killed. Good thing I got inventory space now. Oh, I 
Jesus. I think she can take a power. Roxy. Oh god, I just hope there's not a check in here at the bottom. end. Imagine if there is. So it goes. <laughs> so it goes. Oh god. Well. We got a veteran. Replenish. Heck yeah, Rox. You me. Do this. Beat the heck out of him so far. Take out his little dread lackey. Or maybe leave him just low enough so I can get up like it. Oh no. <gasps> this is bad. Ooh, this is bad. This is bad. I'm the only target now. Mm. Let's weaken you up. Get you. It's getting back up too easy. And my losing kill on you. That's life for you. I could shatter right now, but then I lose the illusions. So I want to do this first. Now I'll shatter. Time to do something else. Wow. <laughs> He's going hard at me. Most of the time, not. <laughs> Come on, invincibility frames and my illusion doing damage. Come on. What is that sound? It's piercing. Oh, no. oh, oh god. There's more. The dredge and their crazy devices. He's gonna get hit by that. <laughs> What's up, dude? When your base is throwing your devices. Oh god, what the? Stay with me. Stay with me. See, now they're acting like they have teamwork. People may ask, like, what's the big deal about this whole enemy story thing? What's so special about it? Well, it's potentially foreshadowing they're working for an unnamed dragon. Maybe it's probably more use. Because obviously, in fighting benefits the dragons. Kill the dragons. Oh god, this is cool. I think this is definitely one you probably want to do with friends. A lot more bearable. Okay, rocks can hold down, but. That is a lot of guys. A lot of guys. Nope. Okay, I guess the portal is part of the stage. Just got to deal with it. Just got to deal with it. I hope more don't come out. <laughs> I opened my big mouth. Sturdy sneaks. No sneak. I was gonna say. Rocks, no! Heal! I'm gonna have to heal you after this. Hold an axe and go down. You. Mr. Dredge. This is getting serious. Oh, snap, there, heal. Take it out to my ass and come right back up. Alright, Rox, let's get you up. Ugh, bloody Sonic emitters. Things we do to save baby devourers. It's pretty funny considering in one of the events we stole them from their mother. Bow. Morality in shifts. I mean, we didn't we didn't kill their mother. 
we could kill the big one. Still. Oh god, is that right now? No. Fox, I'll do what I can for you. You can roll now. Just a little bit. Let's see if we can get him off. There we go. Now back for the win. Anything else I can do with this guy? Shatter him. Shatter him. Let's get him off her. Do everything to him. Yeah! That was a good fight. <laughs> I'm the better ones I had. Alright. Oh boy. Oh. What's some direct control of the facility? Sounds like a truck. Let's go. What the? Why is the flame legion guy having a nerdy dread voice? Or was it the dredge talking? I could have swore I saw that trouble. Sounds like trouble. Hey, cool. The babies are helping us. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. No. They're gonna kill the babies. Oh, God. Imagine if there was some bull crap like that to keep as many of them alive as you could. That'd be so rage reducing. Hey Roxy, you're a ranger, where's your pet? If she gets one here or something? Oh, let's get the baby back up. Save the baby. Oh fuck. <sighs> he mad. Well, that's the way the flame leash is. That's why I miss Tibble. You know, he was chill for a char. These guys are freaking psychopaths. They wanna burn everything. This is basically just... I don't know, how can you... What's the rationale behind attacking a place for maybe devourers a hatchery? I'm sure it might use them as war beasts, but still. Wow. This dreader getting smug. I'll let the babies wrap it up. It looks like we got bigger problems. He stealths allies, woo. That's pretty scary. If he had any left. Alright, let's get some of the babies up. Shh, what should we get? What should we get him up? Fuck. There's gotta be more, yeah. Rocks will help him. Pretty good, pretty good. Pretty good. We're a good team. No tibble, but you're all right. At least you're not like trees us. It just leaves us to die. <laughs> Show no mercy. Oh shit. I don't want to miss. Oh man, we took out all the babies. This is getting out of here. Oh my god, what the. That is a bitchy flame from That's mounted to his freaking hand. Oh man, Rocks, we're in for it now. We gotta be really careful. <laughs> I didn't want to do that. Oh my god, get out of the fire. Alright, alright, good. He's distracted my illusion. We need to put another one on him, though. And get him away from him. Get him off of us. Man, that hurts. Oh. That is a badass one. Imagine if the engineers thought for had that kind of range. People wouldn't complain the engineers these buffs all the time. Maybe they do, though. I don't know. It's hard to say. Eh. I don't know, this is kind of confusing the way to constantly change things, but it does force you to experiment more with class. Some people pissed about the recent patch, like they said they've nerved. It's a story thieves. I don't know. 
No play feet. I don't care. Let's try one. And down he goes. Victory? You there. I'm here on Tribune Grimstone's orders. We had a warning. They came out of the ground before we could sound the alarm. Dredge and flame leap. Yeah. The warband? The station here, yeah. Some are dead, but the others barricaded themselves behind the south gate. Oh man. Here's the key. The invaders were in pursuit. We have to You're wounded. You stay here and warn away anyone else who comes. Aw oh, man, there's more to it. I was hoping that was a finale. <sighs> I'm scared now. Oh boy. Shoot. Go back to your nest. <laughs> this one's sticking with us, I guess. It's different from theirs. Where are we Listen, going? I can't take care of you right now. It doesn't care. There's the gate. Let me handle this. The baby likes her. 